This is exactly how you get a multi-day catastrophic flooding event. I'm not saying that's what's definitely going to happen, I'm just saying this is exactly how you do it. High impact weather forecasting can often be broken down into an ingredients based approach. The ingredients for a catastrophic localized flooding rain event over a one to three day period are deep moisture, a stationary frontal boundary, and enhanced jet stream flow parallel to the frontal boundary. The current setup across the central US includes a stationary frontal boundary separating an extremely hot and humid air mass across portions of the central and southern US from a cooler, drier air mass across the Great Lakes. Along that frontal boundary is seasonally deep moisture with precipitable water values of two inches or more. Aloft, enhanced jet stream flow is parallel to the frontal boundary. The frontal boundary serves as a focal point for thunderstorm development. Very deep moisture ensures that these storms produce very heavy rainfall. Jet stream flow parallel to the front makes the storms track along the front, one after another, like trains at a long freight train. Not surprisingly, we call this training thunderstorms. These three ingredients combined lead to thunderstorms producing very heavy rainfall tracking over the same geographic areas. As single locations experience torrential rainfall rates of 1 to 2 inches per hour over several consecutive hours, disastrous flash flood conditions can arise. A corridor of potentially catastrophic flooding rains of 6 to 8 inches or more is possible Tuesday into Wednesday morning from southern Iowa into northeastern and eastern Missouri. Surrounding this corridor, widespread rain totals of 2 to 4 inches are possible across areas from Omaha to Des Moines, southward through Columbia and Jefferson City, Missouri. Scattered storms will continue along the front from southern Iowa into central and eastern Missouri on Tuesday afternoon and evening, but the heaviest storms are likely to develop after sunset on Tuesday night into Wednesday morning. Along the entire front from the plains into the mid-south, isolated to scattered storms are possible, with isolated instances of severe hail and wind and locally heavy rainfall possible. This is a tough, high-impact weather hazard to communicate. Someone across far southern Iowa to northeastern and eastern Missouri is going to experience a flooding disaster in the next 48 hours, but this community or communities won't be abundantly clear until the event is underway. From Nutrient Ag Solutions, I'm Senior Meteorologist Andrew Pritchard.